Bonucci. Early ball towards Michael Evans. Oh, the header just wide. Well, well Coppendale came for that one. He didn't get there. Well, that was very close to the opening goal. say from Lario but it's been turned in and it's Dean Crow who's got it I think just over 13 minutes gone unlucky for Argyle and unlucky in particular for Romain Lario made an excellent save to start with but uh, couldn't gather the ball as it fell loose it was Dean Crow who was on hand to pop it into the net so the man who started at Argyle puts them behind Job in the back of Frio. Moving towards Dean Crow again. And Steve Howard. Bent getting it forward towards Michael Evans. Nice little layoff for Ian Stonebridge. Evans is to his right. Stonebridge might go all the way. He's found Martin Phillips. Phillips with the charge. 1 1. Well, goal scoring is becoming a little bit of a habit for Martin Phillips. That's his third in the last four games and it was a wonderfully set up move as well Michael Evans was the starting point London in a layoff for Ian Stonebridge he brought the wall forward cleverly looked for a moment as if he was shaping to shoot himself then spotted Phillips' run he found Phillips and Phillips did the rest this is Nichols looking for space to turn another free kick this time right on the edge of the penalty area now somebody has said something in amongst all that I think Paul Watton throwing the ball around hitting someone on the head and uh, the referee taking exception he's given him a yellow card and he's moved the free kick forward to the edge of the penalty area referee just wanting the wall lined up properly it's going to be Valois de Curly oh against the crossbar and that was so close well the Frenchman took that almost nonchalantly then didn't he he's already scored two spectacular goals in two games for Luton Jean-Louis Valois coming desperately close to getting a third then. This is Nichols in towards Dean Crow. Oh, that took a deflection. It's all happening. Looking for Jason Bent on this near side. He's got away from Taylor. Bent looking to curl it towards the far post. Came off the upright, I think. was very very close again Jason Bent curling it towards the far post Stonebridge was closing in he was completely wrong-footed in the end and a sigh of relief from Luton Town that he's going to have words with. It's between him and Russell Perrett. And that is a red card. Well, I have to say that I am slightly puzzled by that. Mr Hall clearly deciding that Evans used an elbow there or something. towards the near post and it's in there from David Frio in stoppage time 
at the end of this first half. David Frio puts Argyle in front. His third of the season. And a brave header it was too. He's got away from Boyce. Can he finish? Well, Avondale having to make a great save. Over the top for Dean Crow to chase. Mario out with the head. Forbes looking to lob it back in. Lario still out of position. Oh, and he got back somehow to turn it away, the goalkeeper. Oh, Stephen Howard. Thought he'd got the equaliser then. Now Nichols. Right inside, Adrian Forbes, who's looked lively since he's come on. Cross in towards Howard, free header, and a great save again. For Romain Lario. This is Taylor looking to try the driven effort. And spectacular stuff again from Romain Larrier. 